Hello all the students from 8th standard. Let us learn expansion formula. The expansion formula the square of a plus b plus c. Let us see the expansion. Now a plus b plus c is square. That means a plus b plus c into a plus b plus c means trinomial multiplied by trinomial. While you are multiplying a trinomial by a trinomial, we have to multiply each term in trinomial to a next trinomial. So we have to multiply a plus b plus c with a a plus b plus c with b and a plus b plus c with c also. So let us see a into a plus b plus c plus b into a plus b plus c and plus c into a plus b plus c. Now there are three multiplications. A multiplication of mono monomial with a trinomial multiplication of monomial with a trinomial and we know that how to multiply a trinomial with a monomial like this we have to multiply each term in trinomial with monomial so in the first a into a a square a into b a b and a into c that is a c next a b into a that is a b b into b that is b square and b into c that is b c plus c into a that is a c plus c into b that is b c and plus c into c that is c square so a square plus b square plus c square and plus now search the like terms find the like terms a b a b a c a c and b c b c these are the like terms so add the like terms here by adding like terms a b plus a b we got 2 a b a c plus a c we got 2 a c and next b c plus b c we got 2 b c so overall we have got the expansion of a plus b plus c is square that is a square plus b square plus c square plus 2ab plus 2ac plus 2bc so that is the expansion we have to remember this formula of expansion of square of a plus b plus c okay let us solve some example based on it examples in that first example the square of p plus q plus 3 p plus q plus 3 is square okay <clears throat> the square of p plus square of q plus square of 3 plus 2 into multiplication of first two term that is 2 into p into q plus 2 into second and third term product that is q into 3 and plus 2 into first and third term product 2 into p into 3 so p square plus q square plus 9 plus 2 p q plus 3 into 2 that is 6 q and plus 3 into 2 that is 6 p so that is the expansion of p plus q plus 3 is square okay now let us solve next example based on that formula next example that is square of 2 p plus 3 m plus 4n square of 2p plus 3m plus 4n 
Now in, in this expression, first term is 2p, second is 3m and fourth is 4n. So square of 2p plus square of 3m plus square of 4n and plus 2 into product of first two terms that is 2p into 3m plus 2 into product of second and third term that is 2 into 3m into 4n and plus 2 into product of first and third term that is 2p into 4m 4n so we have to solve the brackets and we have to complete the products so solve the squares or square bracket square of 2p that is 4p square plus square of 3m that is 9m square and square of 4n that is 16n square plus 2 into 2p into 3m that is 2 into 2 4 and 4 into 3 12 12 pm plus 2 into 3 into 4 that is 24 24 mn and plus 2 into 2 into 4 that is 16 pn 16 n into pn so that is the expansion of given expression or second example now let us solve third example third one is the square of l plus 2m plus n and plus square of l minus 2m plus n so let us solve it so it is square of a square of l plus square of 2m plus square of n plus 2 into l into 2m plus 2 into 2m into n and plus 2 into l into n now plus l square plus negative 2m it square plus n square and plus 2 into L into negative 2M plus 2 into negative 2M into N and plus 2 into L into N. So calculate the brackets and complete the product. So let us do it l square plus square of 2m that is 4m square plus square of n that is n square plus 2 into l into 2m that is 4lm 4lm plus 2 into 2m into n that is 4mn 4mn and plus 2 into L into N that is 2 Ln. So next plus L square plus 4 M square because the square of any negative number is always positive plus N square. Now 2 into L into negative M that is negative 4 Lm. 2 into negative 2 into n that is negative 4 mn and plus 2 ln. Now while adding the opposite terms their addition is 0. So search the opposite terms here these two addition is 0 and these two also addition is 0. Now add the remaining terms add the remaining terms here. So it is equal to L square plus L square that is 2L square 4M square plus 4M square that is 8M square N square plus N square that is 2N square and 2LN plus 2LN that is 4LN 
so that is the expansion of square of l plus 2m plus n plus square of l minus 2m plus n. I hope that you all understand. Thank you.